Okay, here we are. This is a. Uh, I better look. I gotta get the out everything right. Um, this is a Sunday service. Let me put on waist hats like one of those Eastern, you know, Coptic or whatever those people are. Yeah, it's my old goon hat anyway. Yeah, that works well. Well, I gotta look the part. Oh, you say wait a second, Sunday service. Hey, yeah. You know, well, we 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 we. We, we have, you know, you'll have your scripture. Every service has a scripture, right? I have my scripture, too. I don't know. Let me make this look. Yeah, look. Okay. Ah, what the heck. Uh, this is our scripture. We read it from uh, the United Independent Compensatory Code System Concept. This book right here. A Compensatory Counter-Racist Code. This is the 2016 edition by Mr. Neely Fuller Jr. And uh, it's, an exp it's a revised expanded edition. It's a textbook workbook uh, for thought, speech, and or action for victims of racism, white supremacy. It's by Mr. Neely Fuller Jr., as I said before. And then you say, wait a second, brother. Why are you, are you, you know, how could you, uh, are you, bona are, what's your bona fides and stuff like that? And you say this is a Sunday service. What does this mean? Okay, I just realized. <laughs> Active my fraternity. Let me just just a second. Don't don't go any place. Well, stay right there. Uh, just realize it. I mean, there's these things that you know you have your through line from your when you were a kid. You know, I drink water. We drink water in service. Mm. But you know, I pledge my fraternity. My fraternity is a uh, fraternity here. Pentecostal fraternity. Access Pentecostal military fraternity. I'm a I'm part of the third line. It's the Rat Patrol. Because there was five of us. <laughs> because, because, you know, officers... You know, lines have offices, right? Since it was only five of us that made it out of, like, out of, what is it? It's like 40, whatever, 40, 50 people that pledge. <laughs> only five of us made it. Uh, but uh, my my position in the line was uh, right here. Because we had, like, we had, we had your president, your vice president, I don't know if we had vice president, treasurer, Secretary, and then you know, usually have a parliamentary or something like that. But we also had chaplain. I was a chaplain for my line, even though some books they don't. I don't know some whatever. See, so that was my that was my. We in the okay, my position was chaplain, but I was a soul preacher, right? It was soul preacher. What's that mean? Well, no, we had these things, but you. You know, you're in a circle, and then you know, it's like it's like it's like a rap, not a rap battle, but it's like rap. You know, you rap so. I was a good rapper back when I was 15 years old, 16, whatever it is. Anyway, so we're reading from, uh, this is our Sunday service. We're going to attempt to do this every Sunday, no matter where we are on the planet. And uh, luckily for me, I have the, the scripture that we, like I said, the scripture we're reading from always is uh, this uh, compensatory um, counter-racist code by Mr. Neely Fuller Jr. And we'll be extensively reading from this. And it, see, the way you read this book anyway, it's just like scripture. You know, it's like parchments here, parchments there. So I just picked it up. I did breeze. I mean, I always I always look at it all the time. But uh, for this morning's reading, or this, is it afternoon already? It's afternoon. It's Sunday afternoon. It doesn't matter. It's a Sunday. Sunday service, right? Um, and uh, I've, I showed there's, there's like basically nine areas, as they says, of uh, human activity, if you want to put it that way. Uh, or the way the way Miss Neely Fuller Jr. puts it, and the book is broken up. Well, anyway, the areas are um, in alphabetical order. That is, area one is economics. Then you have education. Third area is entertainment. Labor is the fourth area. Law is the fifth area of human activity. Uh, sixth area is politics, or he defines as people relations. Positive, but people relationships. That's what. No, I won't get into that. You can. Decipher that for yourself. Seven is religion. Eight is sex. Uh, nine is war, counter war. Those are the nine areas of human activity. Uh, other people, uh, well, Mr. Neil limits it, says that. Other people want to add other stuff in it. But uh, if you really look at it, all the other stuff, no matter what you have, will fit into all these areas. Plus, they're all connected anyway. So I have chose to do area of uh, the third area this week. Um, well, part of a third area is uh, entertainment. And... Uh, and and in this book you have uh, you have these statements, bold statements. Then you have we also have questions and stuff like that. I'm going to go to a a bold statement on uh, page uh, 126 of this new expanded edition that came out in uh, 
as I said, 2016. Uh, when I get when I get back to Africa, we're probably using the uh, 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 1984 edition because that's what I have in Africa. I have this to it in Africa too. Um, so anyway, the, so to have questions, then you have to think like that. But the area that we're going to deal with today, very briefly. I always say briefly, I don't really mean it. Um, and this is under entertainment. It says, if you are experiencing such luxury and much comfort and having lots of fun within the system of white supremacy, which is racism, do not allow such experiences to interfere with or to take the place of you thinking, speaking, and acting with the intention of ending uh, white supremacy, which is racism, and replacing it with justice. So balance between people. I guess justice, in that sense, as I said before, would be politics is people thing. So the balance between people is like political I don't know. Well, we have to figure that out. This is why we have these readings. But I, I'm merely the reader. <laughs> I'm the imparter. I'm, I'm the preacher. I'm the sole preacher here. You know what I mean? So you have to make your own conclusions, which Mr. Neely Fuller would, have to say, would tell you anyway. But he has an explanation of this, these things. In other words, after you read, if you're experiencing such luxury, middle class life, mm, mm -hmm, and much comfort. Oh, look at this. Man, back. You know, I, I, I when... um. When Frederick K. Price, uh, the, the Reverend Dr. Frederick K. Price was uh, in his heyday, when his heyday, I mean, basically in the, in the 80s, I used to watch him on TV all the time. But one time he said to his, 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 his people, he's like, you wouldn't listen to me if I was in an iron lung. And most people these days don't know what an iron lung is. My mother was in an iron lung, so I know exactly what an iron lung is. Um, uh, you know, he's saying that you have to look good to be a preacher. You know, he said, look at me. He's got a three-piece suit on. You know, he's walking around, fit and, fit and, fit and figure, or whatever. So he has a point, you know what I mean? The messenger is as important as the message. Even if you, uh, what, what you no, let me leave other religious things out, but this is not a religious thing. This is just a sermon, Sunday sermon. Okay. The system of white supremacy, racism, uh, do not allow such experiences, to such experiences such as uh, luxury and, uh, and comfort and, and, and lots of fun. Don't let those, those experiences um, interfere with or to take the place of you thinking, speaking, and acting with the intention of ending white supremacy racism and replacing it with a, with justice. See, in other words, you can ascend to all these, uh, you know, you have all these celebrities, they ascend to the, the, the big houses that you got to maintain. You know, I guess it's the house cost whatever millions of dollars you got to have a whole staff to maintain it throughout the years and stuff like that. That means you have to keep on making that money all the time because you have to have to upkeep the, the properties that you have. You understand what I'm saying? Okay, okay. But he says, don't let that distract you. I mean, in other words, he's not the uh, 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 Mr. Neely Fuller Jr., according to the the, 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 the compensatory uh, counter-racist code. He doesn't uh, say that you can't have luxuries, you can't have fun, you can't have whatever have you, but you can't have it and, and, and take your eyes off of replacing the system of, you know, that we have right now, this, this system that's predicated on, on racism, you know, white supremacy. Well, you always have to keep on striving for that system of justice. So, you, in other words, you can be comfortable. You can have all the cars you want, but it, that's that's that lane. But you, at the same time, and you can do two. You can chew gum and walk at the same time. At the same time, you're supposed to be out this. Uh, the way the way that Doctor Card explains to us, like like Sonia Sanchez says, you know, uh, you know, but do it free us. This luxury that you have, just do it free us. The whole human, you see, that's the that's the whole point. So. Ah, okay, let me keep on reading. Sorry. The explanation of this uh, of this is that the system of white supremacy is the greatest and most powerful expression of injustice among the people of the known universe. As the smartest and most powerful people, the white supremacists, a lot of people have an uh, issue with that, as the smartest and the most uh, white supremacists, right? Right? know how to uh, practice injustice and in such a manner as to provide some of their victims, as that would be uh, uh, non-white people, uh, uh, with much luxury, comfort, and fun. In other words, they let a few people through, and we're enamored with those people with, with their trinkets. I was like, hey, if they can make it, we can make it. You know, it's a system that, that doesn't... Okay, that's right. Figure that out, right? Uh, fun. 
Experiences of luxury, comfort, and fun within the system of white supremacy is no reason and no excuse for not thinking, speaking, and acting to end white supremacy. In other words, you can be running around in your your uh, what's the, those big cars. You can have the big houses, but it's no you can have that, but it's still no excuse for you to give up the struggle to figure out everything that you how how do it free us us. See what see what see how this goes, right? As long as white supremacy exists, all luxury, comfort, fun, entertainment, thrills, parties, that would be air quotes, right? And or relaxation should be for the direct or indirect purpose of ending white supremacy and replacing it with justice. So it says the compensatory counter-racist code as uh, put forth by Mr. Neely Fuller Jr. And remember, this is the book where uh, he has uh, the uh, I mean, this is the uh, this is the book. I mean, everybody should have this. So, like I said, you, you treat it like a uh, how do you say that? You treat it like uh, like scripture. You know, you treat it like a reference book. You know, you don't read it from cover to cover. You take a you take here and there, and you and you do it and you do what you have. Now, remember the inscription that it says, and this was uh, written in 19, 1971. Actually, nineteen seventy one when I started to uh, formally write poetry. Isn't that interesting? When I became a wordsmith, then interesting. Um, and his, his words, his whole page, it says his words, it says, if you do not understand white supremacy, which is racism, what it is and how it works, everything else that you understand will only confuse you. So it says Mr. Neely Fuller Jr. And we, 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 uh, we respect and we follow. This is, uh, this is, this is the text that we read out every Sunday and other days uh, for our Sunday sermons. So um, with that, we let you go for this Sunday. Next Sunday, we'll, 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 hey, as you see, you got a lot. <laughs> 52 weeks in a year? Woo! It's got a long time before we get through this. So uh, stay with us. Us uh, being, uh, well, us, you know, also me, T from the Pattersons, taking the train to Tibet, letting you know what I only suspect.